Voting is not a drag. <laughs> Register to vote. So tell me who you are. Who goes first? All right, I'll go first. Uh, my name is Jessica. So we're here with Headcount. We're a nonpartisan, nonprofit organization um, that registers people to vote at concerts, music festivals, and other types of events throughout the country. Wow, <laughs> that's a place to get the young people that don't bother exactly. to vote. Exactly. So we're trying to get people out to the polls, try to get them informed about like who's on their election, what they're running for, things like that. And how and how 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 are you generally received? Um, pretty good. I'm Kaylin, by the way. I'm a volunteer. We're really good, well received. A lot of people are like, this seems amazing. I never thought that I would see this at DragCon or like at Afropunk or even I think like. Well, some we need black people, especially younger ones. <laughs> to vote. <laughs> yeah, I mean all the young ones, but the black probably more than the Latinas, more than any other group. Yeah. Yeah. And so you, what well, you have, do you have the, you can register them here? Yeah. yeah. This would be for New York State, right? Almost any state we can register. Every state really? except a couple you of them. You should add that to your thing. You can yeah, register them. Nobody's going <laughs> to stop you unless they're from New York. Yeah. So <laughs> no, you have to add that to your A lot of people will say, "Oh, I'm not from New York," and we'll try to, you know, call them over and say, "That's okay. We can no, register you." No, put that you. on your sign. Yeah. Register okay. here to vote in any state. <laughs> you, you probably couldn't have do Hawaii, or could you? We can do Hawaii. Yeah. Hawaii. Yep. Puerto Rico. Uh, no, we can't do it. <laughs> that was a curveball. <laughs> <laughs> yes. And how many people do you, how long, like how many people did you sign up? Yesterday was a very busy day. Yesterday we got between 100 and 150 people signed up to register. And were they all from New York mostly? No. It's a oh, mix. Really? Well, we have lots of people from New Jersey and Connecticut as well. Great. But some people from like Virginia. And you volunteer, Carolina. you don't even get paid for no. this. Yeah, we're you know, all people volunteers. That, yeah. People that go out and try to get you to get money to Greenpeace, they're working, they're actually paid by the hour and they make a commission yeah, no. on what they get. Yeah, no, we're run by volunteers, but... Um, How can you afford to volunteer? I mean, you have rent to pay. We're uh, passionate about this it. This is New York City. Where do you live? <laughs> I mean, well, part of... Well, at least what got me involved was that my best friend works for, works for Head Cal, and the first time I went was to go to Warp Tour, and I was like, well, of course I want to go to Warp Tour for free, uh, and I have to just like register people to vote, and that's totally fine. That's how we get more people volunteering. Matter of fact, like in our turbo votes, which lets you know your localized elections, I tell people, I'm like, hey, you should volunteer for Head Cal because you're volunteering, you're doing something good, and then you get to go to an event for free, like I saw Beyonce, for free, and we love it. <laughs> how do you, but how do you pay the rent and how do you live? Your poor parents slaving away at a well, you nine know, to five I got, I got two other jobs. I survived. <laughs> you had two other jobs? Yeah. Man, how, uh, probably no more than 30 hours each because they don't want to give you any medical benefits. Of Everybody's course. working 30 hour jobs. <laughs> no, I work like 60 hours a week and then do this on the side. God bless you. <laughs> and what kind of job do you have? I work for another nonprofit. I do event planning. Oh. So you both are struggling to make ends meet. <laughs> well, I still live right? with my grandmother. You live with your grandmother, yeah. and where does she live? Um, East New York, Brooklyn, born and raised. Well, my grandmother's from the South. I'm born and raised Brooklyn. You're born where? And raised Brooklyn. Brooklyn? Yeah. Oh, from my best. My helper was from Brooklyn. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know, uh, I'm so glad I stopped. <laughs> and, uh, I, I want to put this maybe, I'm going to put this on the internet. Okay. You'll be doing this when you do this right up to Election Day in different places? All throughout the year, yeah. And we where, have any, play, any festivals coming up that people might see you at? Mm, so, I don't know about festivals. We have a bunch of shows coming up. So what kind of shows? In New York specifically, we're always at like Brooklyn Steel, Terminal 5, Urban Plaza, all of those venues. Pretty much every single week we have we do one at least one I've show. I've never heard of, of those <laughs> venues for music festivals. Yeah. I always miss the well, free music concerts. festivals in the park. <laughs> I never get there. I don't hear about them. I read the review. <laughs> I read the news stories. I, how did I miss that? I love to go to rock festivals. <laughs> well, listen, I want to thank you both. No problem. And I'm thank gonna put you. this up on on YouTube. <laughs> Keep up the good work. <laughs>